We're going to hear from uh, Governor Cuomo here in, in, in just a few minutes, but um, every day this week so far, uh, he has made the case about needing more ventilators. This is this is part of what was said last night on on Fox by the president. New York is a, a bigger deal, but it's going to go also. But I have a feeling that uh, a lot of the numbers that are being said in some areas are just bigger than they're going to be. I don't believe you need 40,000 or 30,000 ventilators. You know, you go into major hospitals sometimes, they'll have two ventilators. And now all of a sudden they're saying, can we order 30,000 ventilators? Margay, President Trump thinks that perhaps the governor of New York is overestimating the need uh, for ventilators. Um, as a New Yorker, I am almost speechless hearing that. I saw it last night. Hearing it uh, makes me um, so angry that I can, frankly, barely speak. Um, here in New York, where I live, we are hearing from doctors and health professionals and public officials every day who are on the front lines. We know that they don't have enough equipment to protect themselves and the communities that we live in right now. They are days away from not having enough ventilators um, to save lives and having to make decisions about um, who to put on a ventilator and whether that's someone's grandmother or mother or child. Uh, that's the reality on the ground. Um, I just hope that Americans are really uh, looking in their hearts and uh, you know, listening to the scientists and the doctors and to, again, the frontline medical workers, but, but also just to those of us who are, are living through this. Um, and there are plenty of firsthand accounts available. Right now, the states are taking the responsibility of this fight. And uh, we're lucky in New York, Governor Cuomo has, has, been, um, has shown great leadership in this um, for, for weeks now. And he had, and his team have people uh, looking all over the world to bring ventilators to New York, which then the governor has promised once we've made it through the worst um, part, of, part of the epidemic here in New York, has promised to share those ventilators and that equipment um, with other states as, as they then get hit. And, um, you know, this is, this is really a time to pull together. And I, I, would, just, I would just ask the president, uh, you know, please do everything you can to help New York. We're still Americans, uh, even though it's a blue state. And uh, this is a virus that doesn't know, doesn't know partisan politics. It's going to hit every community. And when it hits your community, um, you know, you deserve just as much help from the federal government as New York does right now. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.